So essentially we've been uh, practicing what we need to do to be able to mobilize quickly and efficiently um, and become technically and tactically proficient in our artillery tactics. Uh, so mainly what we've been doing here is firing and certifying our different artillery tables to include uh, platoon uh, operations with uh, artillery. The first things that we need to do when we first get started, uh, we have to make sure that we're dry fire verified essentially, uh, making sure that we are receiving the coordinates and the mission from FDC, the fire mission, and uh, we do that without actually firing rounds from the tube. Um, and then after that, that's when we get into the live fire exercise. Uh, whenever you come into a foreign country, it's important to try to get to know the soldiers of that country, get to, uh, you know, network with them, be comfortable with them and let them know, hey, you know, we're here to help, we're here to, uh, to work with you guys. And it's been pretty great working with the Swedish uh, forces here. I was on the Advon unit, so I was here about a few days, five or so days before uh, main body. So we made it a, an effort to go out to their side of camp, uh, get to know them, you know, exchange patches um, and let them know, hey, you know, this is how we do things. That's how do you do things in your side of, uh, of the military? And it was really interesting to get to know uh, the differences and the, uh, the things in common that we have with Wanda Harry. I think it's definitely been an, ex an excellent training exercise um, and I look forward to anything that we had to do in the future and I think that we will be uh, ready when the time comes.